Good morning, afternoon, and or evening. This is Derek Professor Silly Gaming, and we are returning to Leliana in Skyrim. And last time, we uh, followed around a the son of the the guard captain person thing, and we we ended up uh, taking him out in solitude. We came in to turn in the quest. And then we're told that Cicero apparently went crazy. As you can see behind me, I have a fluffy new friend. Uh, because we are playing, uh, we're combining the skill sets of Leliana in the Dragon Age with the general skill sets of bards in Advanced Dungeons and Dragons, uh, ep uh, not episode one, uh, first edition, uh, and with the all the specializations that are available to rogues in Dragon Age, uh, Leliana can now convince animals to to uh, follow her uh, so she's got a a pet fluffy uh, he won't come any further into the sanctuary apparently so without further ado let's go find out what happened with Cicero and then we'll uh, deal with that this time let the elixir do its work you'll feel better shortly ah uh, thank you dear you are most kind the jester's cut feels as bad as it looks, I'm afraid. Damn it, this never should have happened. We knew better. We knew better, and still we let our guards down. Ugh! I'll admit, even I'm having a hard time disagreeing with you. Marrow is dead, I know. But we've got bigger problems right now. Uh-huh, yes. The fool went absolutely berserk. He wounded Vizara, tried to kill me, and then he fled. I knew that lunatic couldn't be trusted. Oh, that's true, I'm afraid. Cicero was a little whirlwind, slashing this way and that. It would have been funny if he weren't trying to murder us all. Don't forget the ranting and raving. About the Night Mother, how she was the true leader of the Dark Brotherhood. And Astrid was just a pretender. Look. We've got to deal with this situation. You've got to deal with this situation. On it. But how, how, how would you like me to handle it there? I want you to find that miserable little fool and end his life. But first, find my husband. Make sure he's all right. After the attack, Onbjorn flew into a rage. When Cicero left, Onbjorn went after him. They disappeared into the wild. Search Cicero's room. Maybe there's something in there that sheds some light on where he might have gone. Let me know the minute you find something. I've got to see to Vizara and calm everyone down. Bested by a fool. Who okay. A fool now. Hmm? Well, we've got some diaries to find. In fact, I believe there's four. We only really need to deal with the one. But we'll grab all four. See what's in here. So, volume one. These uh, show his descent into sanity. Volume two. Volume three. Volume four. Uh, oh, my. Oh, oh, you did follow me in here. Okay. Uh, I do actually want to grab these. I keep, uh, I'm just putting them down, which is not what I want to do. Uh, the kitty is cute, but uh, tends to block doors, don't you? Don't you? Uh, okay, uh, final volume, that's what we need. That will should tell us the thing. How to get into the, there we go. And we'll grab this, because it's worth crazy amounts of money. Can I sleep here? We are drained, so let's uh, let's get some sleep. <clears throat> yeah, refreshed, but hungry. That's to be, that's to be understood. All right. Post nap. 
Have you found something? Yes. Good. Good. Does it say where he may be headed? Yes. The Dawnstar Sanctuary? Whatever for. Never mind, it doesn't matter. You need to leave. Now. Every moment counts. So I want you to take my horse. His name is Shadowmere. You'll find him outside by the pool. Let's just say he's... one of us. Find Arnbjorn. Make sure my husband's all right. And then, send that jester's twisted little soul to the void. In as many pieces as possible. All right. We have some questions we can ask, and I feel it's in Leliana's nature to investigate a little further. So let's ask this one right here. No, nothing. At least, nothing I'm aware of. Well, if I'm being honest, I haven't exactly been discreet lately in expressing my frustration with this whole situation. Obeying the Night Mother, you being the listener, it's ridiculous. No offense. Cicero may have overheard me talking to one of the others about the Night Mother. It's possible I was not entirely respectful. But to go this far, to attempt to murder the leader of a sanctuary, Cicero must pay with his life. There is no other option. All right. Um, I think we're good. Damnable jester. All right. Uh, so let's go grab Shadowmere and let's uh, be on the road. We have arrived at Dawnstar. We're just riding up around to the north part of the shore where we should find Arbjorn. Our cat's still following us. There we go. Should have figured Astrid would send you. Yeah. There's a lot of blood around you, buddy. Ugh, what gave it away? <laughs> Yeah, gotta admit that little jester's good with that butter knife. But don't worry, I gave as good as I got. Cool, where is he? In there, through the door. Some old sanctuary by the looks of it. I would have followed him, but I don't know the phrase. Fortunately, I read books. All right, you convinced me. Doubt I'd be much good to you anyway. The little fop cut me pretty deep. But I slashed him good. Pretty sure I severed an artery. Don't know what you're gonna find in there. But you can probably just follow the blood. Alright. What is life's greatest illusion? Did you just kill a plant? Alright. Well, it looks like my 
companion cannot die, which is useful. Ow. Alright. Oh boy. Oh boy. Nicely done. Excellent. That's true, we have not prayed in a while, and I'm thinking maybe I should switch my deities now that I'm no longer doing the Bard's College. Oh, there you are. All right. <laughs> you caught me. I surrender. <laughs> uh, of these, the most Leliana would probably be this. Might be this one. Traitor? Me? <laughs> Silly assassin, so confused, so confused. And they say I'm mad. If I'm a traitor, so are you. Have you not heard the maiden's voice? Are you not the listener? So walk away. Let poor Cicero live. Tell Astrid you did the job, stabbed, strangled your own poor Cicero. A tiny white lie for a dark assassin. Oh, I'm not in combat, technically. <clears throat> uh, no. No, we're, we're definitely taking him out. Totally blocking my shot. Nope. Nope, that did it. And we're definitely taking all of his clothing. And we'll take his dagger.
All right. I read in a book thing about something about ceremonial weapons. So this is where uh, we got the contract. Let's go ahead and do this. Want to go check that out? Oh, nice dodge. Ooh, you stepped right on it, huh? Alright then. That's fine. Yep, the other one's a Death Lord. Alright, well, let's. Lure him into the bear trap. Ooh, back off. Light armor goes up. Looking this way. He doesn't see me. Hidden. Turn, turn around. I dare you to turn around. Okay, that's you. Okin. Alright, what's the word? What's the word? Nice. Right. Well, it's a little bit drier in here anyway. Alright. Very cold, yeah. Alright, there's the war horn. What? Agent Lor Callan, how dare you attack us? What's your orders? Uh, let's see. Continue to worship at the Talos Shrine. Okay, so they were waiting for someone to come here and put a thing down. Elowen, how dare you? Okay, leveling up. We can manage one of our homes. So, stamina, of course. Especially as we use the arrow archery a bit more and more. As far as the perk goes. Alright, we can take Lockjaw. And definitely this one, because they rearm themselves. So I can place the, the trap down, it'll hit them, and then it'll rearm themselves and hit them again. Uh, that'll be super useful. Bait, on the other hand, just lures things to it, which is also cool, but. Big game hunter. All right, we're just uh, building onto our house right here. So while we're here, honor to you, my fame. Of course. What room would you like me? Very good. I'll make all the arrangements. Alright, Elder Dragon. I think we got its attention. Really don't want to take a full blast from this dragon without some protection. Oh, he's going into the city. Okay. Not today, dragon. Okay, 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 okay. 
Don't get cocky. I'm not playing fair, so screw you. I'm not playing fair, so screw you. That's right. And you know what I'm gonna spend this on, of course. Yeah, I don't think you can breathe right now because of that poison. Haha, <laughs> joke's on you, fucker. Steward, I have an idea that might help to bolster the morale of our people in the- It's a fine day with you around. Yes, hey, about that horn. Falk said I could count on you. You have more than earned the right to purchase property and take the next step to becoming a thane. Speak to Falk when you have the funds, and thank you. Excellent. It was a pleasure, thank you. It's good to see you again. I believe we have enough for that. Splendid. There's a house available right now. See, no we can't afford that. What do we have? And 22,000. Actually, oh, actually, hey. Welcome to solitude. I do. Cool. Excellent. We'll keep doing that. I mean, it's, pleasure. it's not a huge amount of money, but every little bit helps. All right, we're selling potions. We're going to make more potions, so that's going to be good. Uh, let's keep... We're going to make all new poisons. Let's just sell most of this. Okay, nice. Crimes against Skyrim and her people. What say you in your defense? I can make all your problems with the guards go. Done. Now, move along before you get me in trouble. Thane Bryling. Your service. Hey, what are these? All right, cool. Well, hey, may the gods watch over your battles. Friend. Hey, we've got enough money now. The house I mentioned earlier is still available. Yeah, wonderful. Here is the key to your new home. And that's Astrid right there, it looks like. All right. Hey, Astrid. Arnbjorn is safe, and for that you have my thanks. But what of the fool? Is Cicero dead? You bet. Excellent. Once again, you've proven yourself a born assassin. Tell you what. Why don't you hold on to Shadowmere a while longer? He's a fine steed and hasn't been ridden nearly as much as he should lately. And now that this Cicero mess has been mopped up, we can get back to the matter at hand, hmm? Yes, absolutely. What's next? There's just one more target before we strike out at the Emperor. Have you by chance heard of the Gourmet? Read his cookbook? It's become quite a phenomenon. The Gourmet is scheduled to cook for the Emperor at a special dinner. You'll kill him, steal his writ of passage, and assume the role of Master Chef. Festus has been spearheading this part of the assassination plan. He's close to uncovering the identity of the Gourmet. You should report to him. Excellent. Until All right, so on that note, uh, next time, 
we will talk to uh, Festus, I think, I think she said his name was. Uh, it's a weird name. Um, we're going to find out who the gourmet is, and we're going we're gonna to go do that. I wonder, with the mod, just what makes the gourmet a very, very bad person. We don't know. We will find out. Uh, so, you have a great rest of your whatever, and I will see you next time. Ta-ta.